name's Travis and I'm 35 years old. My name's Trisha and I'm 36. And this my is name my... is Macklin. I am almost five. Um, I came to Dr. Cohen um, some time ago and I had had previously a, um, a brain hemorrhage and um, my specific um, situation was an arteriovenous malformation, um, AVM for short, and uh, my particular AVM was located close to the brain stem, uh, which made it, um, as, as we come to find out, very difficult to operate on. I think that, you know, coming to Dr. Cohen was such a feeling of relief for us. We had been through so much as a young couple and there were so many uncertainties surrounding the whole situation. Um, I had actually, when um, Travis had first had his hemorrhage, I was working as a brand new nurse in the ICU. So um, I had a lot of knowledge, even though I was a brand new nurse, um, I had already experienced a lot of what an ABM patient looked like and so it was very scary for me to know that um, you know someone so close to me was was going through that um, and at the time we weren't even married yet we had been together for for about five years I think um, it was and we were very close and just kind of doing our thing with getting through school and getting our jobs and just very focused on that and then all of a sudden one night, you know, Travis called me at work actually and said I have the worst headache of my life, I can barely walk, um, I'm vomiting, and it just it didn't feel right. So when he came into the ER, I had actually just clocked out of my shift and walked down to the ER and met him there and I could tell something was very wrong. So after they did the um, scan and, and said that he had blood in both of the back ventricles of his brain, so both of those back spaces in his brain, um, I, I knew things were, were very serious at that point. Um, again, I just I knew the other situations that I had encountered as a nurse and, and felt very scared and unsure about what the future was to hold for us. After, like Travis said, talking to the different surgeons, um, and, and no one really wanted to or, or thought that they could really handle a, a, a surgery of that severity. Um, I think the uh, most difficult part for me was um, I, after I had the hemorrhage, I had recovered fairly well, but I had known that I had the AVM still looming, you know, figuratively speaking, over my head. I just remember looking at Trisha one time and telling her that I wasn't ready to go yet. I was young and I just, I just wasn't ready to leave. And I was pretty good at compartmentalizing that emotion, but sometimes it would creep into my head. And without meeting Dr. Cohen, I don't know where I'd be right now. The surgery and um, Dr. Cohen's expertise in doing that really enabled us to have the family that we have today. We feel so super blessed to be able just to do the normal everyday things that people may take for granted because at one time we knew what that felt like to have that either taken away or um, have the threat of it being taken away. Looking back on that now, um, we're just so thankful that we had Dr. Cohen in that moment so that we can live um, a life that's that's blessed and a life that is happy. So I always wanted to be a writer and God led me to the nursing profession instead. When we experienced all of this with Travis, um, I decided that this was kind of my opportunity to write a book. It really dawned on me that this situation is something that a lot of people go through, whether it's a ABM in particular or a, another health crisis. Um, and I had a kind of a unique spin because I was in the healthcare profession, and so I really had to. I had a testimony really on what it was like to be in the healthcare profession and then also be 
the family member of someone that was going through a, a, a serious illness. So I decided to write a book mostly to help people have a something something hopeful during their journeys as well. So in the book, um, I just talk about just that, just our journey and how God helped us through so many different things. And there were so many moments in our life at that time that he was there. And especially looking back on it now, it, it was very obvious the things that he led us to, um, that he led us maybe away from, um, that he just led us through through the whole journey. So the book is very um, descriptive of our struggles and then also our triumphs. Um, most importantly, I would like to um, thank Dr. Cohen for giving me the opportunity to continue my life, um, to be able to uh, raise a family, uh, be happily married. Um, I own my own business, so I am able to enjoy my work every day quite overwhelming at times to think about it, but um, I owe Dr. Cohen um, everything.